Adam, I'm so very happy to be able to call you my husband and to know that today is our wedding day. This has been what feels like a roller coaster ride. You are a huge blessing to me, you and Ellie both. I love you so much. <laughs>this whole year has been stressful on everyone especially for me and Kayla I'm the father of the bride my name is Jay and my baby girl meeting the man that we all believe is the man of her dreams Adam to you I want to say welcome to the family you're in for a bumpy ride I was just like seconds away from giving up and then I just stumbled across her, and in my mind I was saying, who is that? I have to talk to her. Yeah, you said that uh, the color is for Ellie because it's September and that's her birthstone, and then the rose was because I love roses. Oh, that's, that's very sweet. <laughs> I hear them boots. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Come here, you. I'm so proud of you. When y'all two first started dating, Adam came up to me. He was like, she's the one for me. And two months later, you know, got engaged. As y'all know, she's having a baby come September. And we're looking forward to that. So this just keeps on getting better and better for her mother and I. Kayla, he is the man of the house. He gets the last word in every argument. No, nope, that's, hey, hey, Adam, don't you dare be scared to let that last word be yes, dear. P.S. Ask your groomsmen about their socks, then open your gifts. This could make for a fun picture for you to look back on with the guys. Did it? Socks. Okay, <laughs> open your gift. Open. Super Dad socks. Right, <laughs> what? <laughs> I got Batman. Every time I took her home from like a date, I kept telling myself, I'm gonna marry this woman. And I mean, there was just something about her that made me fall in love with her each and every single day. Mm. You look handsome. Thank you. <laughs> I'd say you look beautiful, but I can't see. <laughs> Kayla, this is my favorite picture of us together. <laughs> I was really sad that we didn't get to take more at my wedding. Yeah. Kayla does not know how to shake her butt. Yes. So, I have to teach her in her dorm, in front of the mirror, how to shake her butt. I still don't. I still don't. This looks beautiful. Time to get married. This is the best event of my life, number three, so you know. Number three? Yeah. Number one is I married mom. Number two is I had you. I got you in my life. Number three is I get to give you to somebody. I got a lot of lessons left to learn. But I'm not even close. I couldn't imagine my life without you. I promise to love you for the rest of your life and be loyal to you. You have been a blessing to my life. Adam, I promise to love you through the ups and downs in life. I promise to always go on random trips with you no matter where we go, whether it be a day trip somewhere or to vintage stock and spend hours there looking at movies. To love you and keep you in check when you want to buy all the dogs. 
<laughs> in the world, even though we already have two amazing dogs that we keep uh, that would keep us busy and our future children. I look forward to growing up with you and all the adventures that lie ahead of us. I love you. But I know a love like this doesn't come around every day. And I just can't bring myself to give up right now. Not this way. Cause I love you and I want to hold you when we're old and gray. Oh, but love like this don't come around, don't come around every day. really have come in and made her so happy. <laughs> you're so special. So I want to congratulate you guys. Hope your marriage is wonderful. And congratulations on your coming baby, Ellie. When your daughter comes, watch out for her. Make a good dad, okay? This will be the easiest thing if I let it. And I can't be too afraid. I'm leaving everything on the table You can have my heart Confucius, a very famous Chinese philosopher, said once, he told us, there's a famous saying about a profound secret to the happy of marriage. What he said is, he said, So hopefully that help you guys on your marriage in the future. Um,